Hey guys, it's me, Master 627 and today I am back with another Saturday story. Today it is Sunday. <laughs> yes, Sunday, September 16, 2018. Now normally this would have been out yesterday, but guess what? It's out on Sunday instead because I forgot. By the way, this is also the last video of the day. And as you can tell by the title of this video, it is a very interesting story that many of you will possibly love, including viewers like yourselves, assuming any of my original viewers came back yet. Um... Let me know in the comments below, is the screen starting to work for you? Any of the viewers that are still having problems, is it starting to work yet? Let me know below in the comments. But yeah, with that said, let's get into today's Sunday story instead of Saturday. Don't worry, this Saturday it'll go back to Saturday, don't worry. It was just because I forgot yesterday. So, today's story... Uh, meant to be yesterday's, is about the two times I went to St. Augustine back a few years ago. Now, the years I went to St. Augustine were 2012 and 2013. Now, the days I went in for 2012 was from Thursday, May 24th, all the way to Friday, May 25th. Now, does that date sound recognizable to you? Yep, Thursday, May 24th, 2012. We went to St. Augustine for around two days, and it was a lot of fun. Now, um, during that time, I was still actually in actual school rather than homeschooling of where I am now. So it definitely got me the chance to um, do that. So yeah, I was still in um, actual school rather than homeschooling. Which, um, I actually didn't do homeschooling until 2014. But, um, yeah, during, um, those two times, and I'm, I'm gonna explain the 2013 one after the 2012 one. So basically, what the 2012 one was all about was, um, basically, the first ever place we went to when we were there was the, um, the old jail, which had a lot of cool things that I loved imaginably. Now, during this time, uh, I was around nine years old, almost 10. Um, yeah, I was turning 10 that year, but I was still nine during the time we went. Um, yeah, this was around six and a half years ago because 2012 is six years ago. So the first place we went to was the old jail, which had a lot of cool things that I remember. I completely remember the memories. Um, as you can probably see, I don't have any pictures of it because, yeah. I actually do have no pictures of it because first of all I didn't have a phone yet or an actual camera to actually take pictures so I don't have any pictures but um the the jail was actually a fun part it was actually really cool exploring everything that it offered for um me to actually explore I actually explored with a lot of my cool friends one of my best friends Happened to be a um, amazing friend named Caleb who I still have amazing friendship with to this day I haven't seen him for over four years by the way um, That's actually true and I still have not forgotten about him But I basically was with him the whole day of the first day and it was just a lot of fun um, The next place I think we went to after the old jail We had a lot of fun there explored everything it had to offer and then after that, we went up to the lighthouse, and a little fun fact, I know you can't see this, but hold on. I know you can't see this at all, but I actually do have a little picture of it. Like, I actually have a little sculpture of the actual lighthouse from St. Augustine. I know you can't see it, but I'll show you in a vlog later on in um, the next few days. But, hold on. Yeah, I actually have one. It's the exact replica of the lighthouse from St. Augustine that I got during that time. Now, I actually bought it on, um, I can't remember if it was the first or second day. I think it was around maybe like the first day. Um, I bought a cool sculpture of the actual lighthouse from St. Augustine. So I'm very glad I still have that. I almost thought I, I, almost thought I lost it when we were um, moving to this house. But, um... Uh, 
Yeah, I'll show you guys that I actually have it um, in a vlog later on in time. But um, we went up to the lighthouse. Another one of my friends, which I still love to this day, we both climbed up the lighthouse. It was just amazing. We got all the way to the top. And another one of my friends, alongside with my best friend Caleb, was an amazing friend called Jaylen. I still love her to this day, and it was just amazing. I haven't seen her for the exact same amount of years as Caleb, which was kind of unsurprising. So basically, we, all three of us, all cl climbed up the top and went all the way up and saw the, all the amazing views we could see from up top the lighthouse. Honestly, it was freaking awesome, and I still remember it to this day. I still wish I had pictures of it, but don't worry. I have the exact lighthouse um, sculpture, which I'm very glad I again still have. But um, I actually keep it on my nightstand, and I actually didn't do this in my old house because I actually forgot I had it. Uh, yeah, a little fun fact. I actually never had it in the, um, the other house because I forgot that we had it. Now, um... Yeah, we went up to the lighthouse. It was just a lot of fun. Saw everything um, up above that we could see in the background. And it was just a lot of cool things that we could see from there. All of us had a fun time. Every single one that went with us was a lot of fun. Now, guess what happened then? Later on the first day, at night, we went all the way over to the beach, which is kind of uncrazy thinking that I probably don't even remember doing that. But, we did, and it was just a lot of fun no matter what. We actually did do a lot of cool things, despite this, and obviously as you can see I'm playing Minecraft in the background while I discuss the story. But yeah, um... After that, again, like I said before, we went to the beach for um, the night, but it didn't actually end there. Seeing as we obviously uh, slept in a hotel for over a night, which we only was there for like one night and then left the second day, which I'll get to the second day right around now. All right. So yeah, first day was done, obviously, again, the old jail, the lighthouse, and the beach. May 25th which was the second and last day of it. Um, we, um, we went over to the, um, the forts, which was actually awesome. Like, I'm actually not kidding. It was just an amazing time that I never forget. I actually still wish I had pictures of it, but I had a lot of fun there at that point. And um, yeah, the forts were awesome and they, it, it just brings me back like a lot of memories because um, last time I ever was there, fun fact, was actually 2013, which was actually kind of weird. But um, yeah, um, that's basically um, the second day. Um, hold on, I actually need to remember, did we do anything else on that day? Uh, I do remember on the way back home to my house we actually went out somewhere i can't remember where we went out but um on that day but one thing i actually do remember is what we had um for lunch on that day yeah i actually remember um it was actually kind of funny because i actually again do remember what we had but hold on actually yeah i remember let me see. Okay, this is probably the most hilarious thing we ever did for lunch on that day. Okay, hilarious thing. Are you ready? Hold on, let me shoot this guy. Um, the most hilarious thing we ever had for lunch because there was nothing else left. We had ice cream for lunch. Are you freaking serious? I'm actually not kidding. We did. No, really. We actually did have ice cream for lunch because there was nothing else around and we just, we wanted to just choke around and have something else. But after that ended, we just, after we did that, we pretty much just left and just didn't do anything. So what we're going to do, well, yeah, um, we pretty much left after that and just went back home. By the way, we were dropped back home, back, well, actually, this was not in the house that we were in previously. This is about, like, um, the house we were in previously before the one we were just in. And actually, a little fun fact, I might actually make a vlog, um, like, driving by that house 
not going in it because obviously we no longer own the rights to it but i may make a vlog later on actually driving by um the old neighborhood that it was in but who knows i might not but yeah we after that we pretty much just drove back and um the day was pretty much over um, so yeah, that was the 2012 one. Again, the old jail, the lighthouse, and, um, the fort. And, uh, having ice cream for lunch, which is crazy. So now, on to the 2013 one. So, wait, wait, wait. Do any of, wait, do we even remember? Okay. So yeah, the 2013 one. This one started on Thursday, May 23rd, and ended on Saturday, May 25th. Fun fact, both of them ended on the same day. But this time, it was two nights. Now, a little fun fact. You want to know what's funny? This was actually owned by the other class. And I was actually not a part of uh, this grade yet. But um, actually, do I even remember what grade I was in? Um, I was uh, I was like 10 years old during the time. Almost 11. But um, wait, what grade was I in in 2013? Okay, so basically, later on in the year, in 2013, I was in 5th grade. However, this was during the final days. Well, actually, technically, I was already in 5th grade during this time. So basically, the grade that allowed, well, technically, yeah, the grade that was above me, this is where Rose, Crystal, and Nenpros were in, because they were both in the same grade, but... Um, I think they were in 5th um, grade, about to be in 6th grade, so... Um, yeah. Guess what happens? You wanna know how I went? Their um, teacher freaking allowed me to go even though I wasn't even in their class. Yeah, that was a really, really lucky shot because I never expected that to ever happen in my life. So they allowed me and I went with them even though I already went the previous year in 2012. Basically, it was the same thing all over again, except for the fact that I had both Enpros and Rose Crystal with me at the same time. So yeah, um, again, same thing all over again. However, on the 25th, there was a bit of a difference, mainly due to the fact that we actually did something else later on. So basically, we obviously, um, uh, we actually went to the fort on the first day. And the old jail on the first day as well. So we went, we went to both on um, the um, the first day. I'm actually trying to remember if we actually went to the lighthouse during that time. Did we? Yeah, we did go to the lighthouse in 2013. So, yeah. And it was actually on the second day, May 24th, 2013. And that was the second day. Um, but everything changed because obviously I went with a different um, class. So obviously, that changed everything for probably a good reason. So basically, I I didn't actually want to reveal to anyone that I was there the pre- Well, technically, I actually did reveal it, but I did not want to reveal any spoilers about what they were about to see. And yeah, um, so I didn't do that, but I did tell them I went the previous year. So basically, we went to the White House all over again, which was amazing as well. And on the second night, um, um, we obviously stay in a hotel for the second time, two nights now, but, um, we actually didn't do much after, like, after the lighthouse, that was pretty much it. There was nothing else, basically did whatever we wanted for the rest of the day after. But after that day ended, it was May 25th. 2013, which was the day we left, and it was also day three. One big difference, however, is that we actually went to a place we actually didn't go the previous year, and that was one of the shops that we went to. Actually, it was, I think, a half shop, half museum for some reason. I can't remember exactly, but I knew that it was a bit different. So I explored that for the first time in a long time since I didn't do it the previous year. And I loved it from every single point. When I revisited the White House on the second day, I was like, oh my God, I remember this. I was here a year ago. Like, uh, and yeah, we actually went to the White House on the exact day that we did it a year before. And um, I was like, wow, I remember this. <laughs> and then I just went all the way to the top again. Just to see how the amazing view was all over again, which was great. 
and I went back to the old jail again. Obviously, on the same day, we went to um, the fort. And I got to see the old jail again, which was great. They, um, both Emperor's and Rose Crystal got to see it for the first time in a long time. So, yeah. Um, then we went to the fort again, again, as I said. Um, got to experience that again for the second time, which was great. All of those were just amazing memories and will never be forget and will never be forgotten. So yeah, pretty much after May 25th, we basically just randomly just went back home because it was over. Or actually, I think we went back to the school and then after that we went back home. And then the day ended after we just did whatever we wanted for the rest of the day. And then ever since then, we have never went back. And you want to know why? Because yeah, we just never went back, which honestly, I wish we could go back there one day, but it's okay if we don't, but it would be cool to go back there one day. But anyway, that's it for this week's Saturday story. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It was definitely a lot of remembering. I had to remember everything we did out of my own head. I had to remember it out of my own memory, and I basically do remember everything now. Yep. I had to go back and look at things that we had back then. So basically, yeah. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Please tune into the next episode on the 22nd. And yeah, guys. Goodbye. Man, those were just definitely fun times. I'm never forgetting them. And I'm still very glad that I still have the lighthouse sculpture. That means I'll see you tomorrow. Actually, while we were in the shop slash museum, we actually went into this cool, amazing, rainbow-themed room where you had to basically run, basically, throughout uh, the room. If you run, if you ran through the room, everything, like, all the colors would change. It was just a great room. That was one thing I forgot to mention. All right, now that's it. Can't believe I forgot to mention that.